Hi there, thank you so much for choosing my seated stretch video. We are going to stretch all over our body. All you need to do is get yourself sat comfortably. This is going to be really good for people who work at home, uh, work at a desk, if you're just feeling quite tight, if you've got an injury and you don't want to stand up, or if you're a senior. So, get yourself sat and ready and we'll get going. We should now be ready for our first stretch. So to begin, I'd like to sit with your feet firmly placed onto the ground, toes and knees pointing forwards, and let's sit up nice and tall, shoulders back, chest is proud. And we'll begin with a shoulder stretch. So we're going to take that right hand out, palm facing forwards, and then we're going to take it across the body, hooking underneath the left arm. Shoulders are down here, and we're really reaching with that right hand to the left side. Now we're going to hold our stretches for roughly 30 seconds, working on the deeper muscle tissues and making sure we feel the benefit from each stretch. Now if you feel uncomfortable, just feel free to come out of the stretch at any point. And we're going to be doing stretches all over the body to help ease any tension and stress. This year has been a bit of a strange year. Maybe you've been at home more, you're not moving around as much, you might be working from a desk. So we might be feeling a bit tight. So I'm hoping these stretches will really help to ease any discomfort. And let's release. Maybe give it a little bit of a wiggle and then we're moving on to the other side. So left hand out, palm forwards, comes across the body and hooks underneath that right arm this time. Shoulders down, sit up tall. We're stretching the shoulder here. So you might be someone who's been working from a desk, maybe you've got a little bit of pain in the back, I've been hearing a lot of that, especially since Covid, we was not doing as much movement, being confined to our homes. So it's really important that we do take time to look after ourselves and have a little bit of a stretch. You can do this at any time of the day, morning, afternoon, evening. If you're working from a desk, maybe do it after a few hours of work and that should help ease any discomfort. So really try to schedule a point in your day to look after yourself. And let's release, give it a little bit of a shake and a wiggle. Now we're going to move on to an arm stretch. So we take the right hand out in front, we're going to flex the hand here, and we're going to gently guide the fingertips towards the body. Now I don't need to pull or yank, just gentle, so you can feel that stretch in the arm. I'll just turn to the side so you can see here. Yeah, if it is too much with that arm in line with the shoulder, you can always take the arm a little bit lower. Now, you just have to listen to your body. And let's release and have a little bit of a jiggle and a wiggle and swap sides. So left hand coming up now, flexing the hand and just gently using our hand to bring back the fingertips towards the body. Don't pull, just guide to where you can feel that stretch. And again, if it's too much, you can take the arm a bit lower. Making sure we are sitting up nice and tall, lengthen the spine tummy button pulled back and we're breathing.
and release. Well done. We might have brought a bit of tension with those stretches into the upper body. So we'll just loosen that out. I'd like to tuck your chin into your chest and we're just going to do some nice gentle half circles here. Slow and controlled movements. Feel that in the neck, into the shoulders. And tuck the chin to chest. Nice and slowly bring the head back up. Now we're going to do a twist. So twists are really good for lower back tension. So we're going to take our arms out into a cactus or a goalpost, whichever, whatever you like to call it. And we're going to add the twist by inhaling. As we exhale, we're going to bring the right elbow forward, the left elbow back, and see if we can look over that left shoulder. And twists are good for lower back tension, they're good for digestive health, and good for detoxing the blood in the body and release inhale exhale in the other direction so right elbow back left elbow forwards and look over that right shoulder this time and release Nice work. So now we're going to move on to some lower body stretches. So I'd like you to just move back a little bit into your chair. We're going to lean back slightly as we lift that right leg, taking hold of the shin and bringing that right thigh towards your chest. Now it's quite tempting to let the shoulders lift here, but press the shoulders down, long neck, and just relax the upper body. Try not to hold any tension here. release and let's swap sides so leaning back as we bring that left thigh to chest now relaxing the upper body Well done. And I forgot. 
forgot to mention, because we did the stretch before where we moved back a little bit, you will need to move forward a little bit on your chair for this stretch and we'll swap sides so that left foot's coming out now, foot is flexed, heel down, sit up tall, hands on the hips, hips are square and then when we're ready, we're going to fold forward, so just tilt to where you can comfortably hold the stretch. Breathe in. Inhales to lengthen the muscles and exhales to soften the muscles. so you don't miss out on any of my future content. I hope to see you on the next one. Thank you.